What's good, y'all? Up in this bitch with another one, man. Hey, man, I got something new, bro. Again, I got something new. Coming up with new shit right now, man, because I'm taking a little break from the music, man, because I feel like all them reactions I'm doing, man, ain't really hitting too good, man. So I'm gonna take just a little break away from the music and I'm gonna do something a little better, man. Um, I'm gonna do some motherfucking Maury, man. And I've seen other people do reactions to Maury, bro. And Maury sometimes asks me, like, what the fuck, man? But, like, um, let's just see what this bitch is about, man. Wait, hold on. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Ooh, fuck. Damn, hey, man. I felt naked for a second. You feel me? But nah, I said we got uh, uh, Maury, man. And this one right here, I don't know. This one's crazy. It says, Mom, DNA will prove that I had a baby with your husband. It just seems, this is like some twisted family type shit. I don't know, bro, but somebody sent me this shit and uh, uh, I clicked on it, man. And we're going to see what this bitch is about. So. I ain't even gonna talk too much, man. Y'all, I just, I'm just gonna get into the video, man. Okay, everyone, now, sitting in our secluded room is a woman who has been on our show 19 times. 19? Damn. Her name is Shalanda. Say, man, this is what I feel. I feel like if you've been on this motherfucker like 19 times, man, I mean, after the first time, you should just save the embarrassment and just go away, man, because. And you may not recognize. I mean, why the hell. Why the hell you want to be on a show 19 times, man? That's just, that's just, that's just telling everybody that you're a fucking slut. You know what I'm saying? Like, because Shalanda has lost 150 pounds. Oh, but, you know, you might, you might remember, okay. I guess you will remember her past appearances because Shalanda has tested 17 men in hopes of... Bro, she's a fucking slut, bro, I'm telling you. Look, man. Now, it shows welcome. It shows how much bitches don't have respect for themselves, man. If they go and I mean 18 motherfuckers, bro. Most bitches, I mean most bitches, some bitches, you know what I'm saying, with class at least like most guys they've ever fucked is probably fucking five, six, not even seven, you know what I'm saying? Like from bitch from the hood, probably like 10, 11. But like 19, god, god damn. She she Let's just see what this bitch is Terrell, about. Next to me, her husband. You're not the father, bro. Because You're Terrell not the is father. here today because he has a secret he wants to reveal to Shalanda. So before we hear the secret, take a look at Shalanda and Terrell's history on our show. For four years, we helped Shalanda try to find her daughter's father. 17 different men were proven not to be the dad. Damn. I bet that fucking sucks, bro. That fucking sucks. Going in there trying to find uh, uh, your baby's father, and for four years y'all test seventeen men, and they ain't. that means you fuck seventeen motherfuckers during that period. Whenever you felt like you was uh, 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 conceived by somebody, you know what I'm saying? Within that month, that just shows character, man. Bitches gotta be doing this shit on purpose, though. Bitches had to be doing this on purpose because how in the hell? Of the men that I brought to the show, she heard 17 different results. At times, it was shocking. Not. Hell yeah. Ain't nobody want. Fuck no. Hell no. Ain't nobody want to be her baby daddy. What the fuck? Returned with a new child, Tyrell Jr. And once again, they needed a DNA test. Does he have any reason to doubt you? Yeah, yeah, I cheated on him. Damn. In the case of two-month-old Tyrell Jr., Tyrell, you are the father. Oh. <laughs> shit. Oh, shit, yeah. So, been a long journey. Let me ask you about because I haven't seen you in a while. How have the last few years been going? It's been good, Lori. Um, got a good life. Um, my wife, she's went through a transition of, you know, losing the weight. And, um, Amazing transition. transition. I mean, 150. I mean, that's good, though. You know what I'm saying? That's good. You can see a big difference, man. Congratulations on that. But she's still a fucking slut, bro. Like, that don't change you. Man. Well, I had an affair. Uh, you know, it's, 
It's been going on for a couple of years. And what's the second part of the secret? It's with my stepdaughter. Wow. That motherfucker, you's a bitch, bro. This fool's a bitch. He needs his ass whooped, bro. He needs his ass whooped, bro. Oh, God. I can't even stand this motherfucker, man. I can't stand this motherfucker. You's a bitch, bro. You's a bitch. You's a bitch. Oh, God. You's a bitch. Look, man. And for and for a daughter, bro, and for him, man. I don't know how old the daughter was. I don't know if she was uh, uh, under or over 18, whatever. But either fucking way, it shows that that bitch don't have no fucking class. Because a real daughter would be like, um, you a weirdo, fool. I don't... Nah, nah, you're dating my mom, dog. Like, nah, fuck you, fool. Like, you're a fucking weirdo, mom. Your whole, your, your, your boyfriend's trying to get at me. You know what I'm saying? And for the that's mom bad. to fucking... First of all, to have an affair, that's bad. Her daughter, that's worse. For real, man. But there's another part to it. They have a two-year-old son? They have a two-year-old son? Wow. Wow. That's Shalanda's grandson. Yeah. When was the last time you and Deanna were together? Bro. That's so they got some fucking problems, bro. All these motherfuckers got problems, bro. On oh, God, that bitch got problems. The mom got problems. The fucking stepdad, bro. What the fuck is wrong with him, bro? I hope somebody, I hope somebody get his bitch ass for that, bro. Because that's some weirdo shit, bro. Over here getting at the stepdaughter, you little weird ass bitch. This one guy that she used to go out with, but the baby looks nothing like him. And my wife even said that. So you have to reveal this to Shalanda now. Here's your wife, Shalanda. It's just another case of those twisted families, you feel me? Like, you have those everywhere, bro. Like, like, and then twisted motherfuckers joining families and shit, like stepdads and all that, like. Let me see. Keep on playing this shit. I'm gonna keep on playing this shit. She's hurt, bro. She's fucking heartbroken. This motherfucker is a dirt bag. And he has the audacity to even like he has the audacity to talk to her daughter, man. I mean, your daughter, I mean, look, if you're a mom and you have a daughter, man, that's supposed to be your best friend right there, your partner and everything. Your daughter stabbed you in the back, and so did your fucking uh, 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 husband, man. Your husband and your daughter both stabbed you in the back, had a baby, bro. You can't trust nobody, man. Look, and it don't matter how you raise anybody, bro. It's all, people going to end up how they want to end up. If they want to end up good, that's good for them. If they want to, up, if they want to get brainwashed by society, end up like a fucking piece of shit, you know what I'm saying, that's how it's gonna be, um, fucking, like, it just makes no sense, it makes no sense, it don't make any sense, man, I'm telling y'all that right now, shit, 
She don't deserve that. Drop him, drop that daughter, and don't. And she trusted you, you dirt bag ass. That's fucking crazy. The honor's here, okay? And you might as well get it all out, right? Okay? And then you can <laughs> Wow. Yeah, boo that bitch. Boo that bitch. Boo that bitch. I don't know how a fucking female has the. Oh God, oh God. Beat her fucking ass. Beat, beat her fucking ass. Like I said, like I said, it don't matter how you raise somebody, man. They're gonna end up however the fuck they want to end up. And like I said, they want to end up good. That's then good for them. If they want to end up like that, then it's just on their own, man. Some people are just twisted in their own ways. You know what I'm saying? Like twisted as fuck, man. It's not even funny, like. Right? Took care of you, fed you, fucking clothed you, fucking all that shit. I mean, of course, she's no angel. You know, the things that's been going on in the past or whatever. And, you know, one thing led to another. We were confiding in him. Is that it? Basically, yeah. I don't know if he knows this or not or whatever. But in the past, she slept with one of my boyfriends. So, so I mean... What? Well, your stepdad. Did you yeah. just have something with your boyfriend? You know you did. We've, I've, we've buried that. We've buried that. We're not even gonna. It, it never out. happened. Yeah, it, she's a no, fucking liar, you bro. Run away, do what you want to do, and I try to get you out with my street. boyfriend still. Are you serious? She lying, bro. Look, and you wanna look, bro, cause that daughter, man, cause she didn't even, she wasn't even paying attention. And I guess she just can't got to her attention. Like, go look. You just say I was whoop whoop, fuck you, bitch, whoop all that. You know what I'm saying? Like, 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 you gotta really. <clears throat> nah, fuck that. Whoop his fucking ass. Uh, that's what I'm talking about. You don't need that shit, girl. You don't need that shit. You told me you were trying to go to the store. Are you serious? Wow. Are you? Oh, my God. Okay. Wow. Shalanda. Shalanda. That fucking... Is, it, is, it, is this marriage over? It's done. Yeah, that's right, shit. If you would have gave him a second chance, you's a dumb bitch, too. Oh, God. You's a fucking... Wow, hey, let's see the Tesserian, the Tesserian. He has to be the father, bro. It does kind of look like him. It does kind of look like him. And I've been opening these envelopes a long, long time. And this might be the one I do not want to open. Cyrus, how old? He'll be two months old. What is he called, Terrell? Dad. In the case of 23-month-old sire, Terrell, you are not... Why the fuck do you run off, bitch? It's all out, though. Hey. 
Hey. Damn, I got goosebumps like a motherfucker, bro. I don't know if y'all see that shit. Damn. Damn. That shit was fucking crazy. Oh my god. Hey, the truth is Hey, it don't even matter that he he ain't the father no more. The truth is out already to the point to where like <clears throat> That motherfucker ain't gonna be able to get away with a goddamn thing, man. Like, oh God, like that motherfucker deserves to get his ass beat. Everything, man. You gonna mess with? You gonna get with 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 somebody? You gonna attach the attach yourself to their daughter? You know, you probably raise them. And the next thing you know, if they get to a certain age, you wanna start engaging in sexual acts, man. That's not. If you gonna be a father, man, be a father, man. Don't go in somebody somebody's life trying to. Destroy their family, man. Tell their family apart, man. Because this motherfucker did that. If he wouldn't have walked into their family, this, none of this would have happened. He tore their whole family apart. And he's going to have to live with that for the rest of his life, man. And even though that baby is not... He thought it was his, but it's not. So, that's just something he's going to live with. He tore apart on his family. He looked bad on fucking national television. You know what I'm saying? What, like, I'm telling you, man. Like, that fool's a bitch, bro. But nah, man, what you guys think about that video? If you guys like, you guys subscribe. I'll catch you on the next episode. I don't know.